1. Calculate the magnitude of the following vector. So here we have, for example, if we have one line, which is x and y, this one is x, this one is y, right? Direction x, direction y. So magnitude is actually the length. Okay, so the length here, so what we do is that we use hypotenuse, right? So do you, if you still remember x square plus y square is equal to l square. So l is equal to so x square plus y square. So th this is what we are going to do here to find the magnitude. So for a, we have 3, 2. So here the magnitude is equal to, so you see here, set x square plus y square. So x is 3, 3 square plus this one is 2 square. So 3 square plus 2 square, we get 3.606 units. Okay, and then for b, we have negative 4, negative 7. So here, magnitude is equal to set negative 4 square plus negative 7 square. So basically, I just use my calculator. So this one is 8.062 units. Okay. So C, we have 0, negative 4 over 7. So magnitude is equal to so 0 square plus negative 4 over 7 square, which is equal to 4 over 7 units. So D, negative 12i minus 5j. So here magnitude. So we know this one is the value of x and this one is the value of y. So we know that here x square is negative 12 square plus y is negative 5 square. So here we are going to get 13 units. Okay. And then E is 6i. So 6i So E is 6i. So 6i, this one is the value of x. So magnitude is actually 6. I mean, even without calculating, you can see that the value is 6. But never mind, this one is 6 square plus 0 square. So here you get 6 unit. To find the unit vector in the direction of the following vector. So what is the unit vector? So here unit vector is equal to so the vector divided by magnitude so if you have the vector you need to know what is your magnitude so the vector divided by magnitude you get uh, unit vector so for example if the vector is xi plus yj so the magnitude is uh, x square plus y square then you can find what is your unit vector So here A, 3i plus 2j. So you need to find what is your magnitude first, right? So here, magnitude is equal to third. So you have x and y. So this one is 3 square plus 2 square. So here we get third, 13. So unit vector is equal to See here, vector divided by magnitude. So, this one is 3i plus 2j divided by 13. Okay. So, b negative i minus 9j. So, here magnitude is equal to. So, you see here, x is negative 1 square. This one is negative 9 square. So, the magnitude we get 82. So, unit vector is equal to the vector negative i minus 9j divided by unit vector is 82. Okay, C, we have 4, 0. So, you see here, to do it in unit vector, we must write it in term of i and j. 
So this one is actually for I plus zero J or just for I. So here magnitude, you can see that the magnitude is actually four, right? So this one is four square plus zero square. So you ended up with four. So unit vector is equal to vector divided by magnitude. So for I divided by four. So actually you get a unit vector of I. Okay. For D, you have negative 8, negative 15, right? So, this one is negative 8i minus 15j. So, magnitude is equal to, set negative 8 square plus negative 15 square. So, here we get 17. Okay, magnitude. So, you need vector is equal to vector divided by magnitude. So, this one is negative 8i minus 15j divided by 17.